I know I look rough, but it's because I got up, I started cleaning, I washed all my dishes, and I cleaned the kitchen, and I am now making breakfast. So, of course, Lucky was being difficult, and he wanted, like, his own separate meal. Look, man, I can't be eating bacon. Bacon gives you cancer. So, he comes up, here, I don't want that. I don't want that. So, I had to make him a breakfast sandwich personally for him because you know el señor de la casa has to have whatever he wants i'm about to get flicking the wrist with these eggs these waffles i still want a waffle and these bacon you specifically said you didn't want no waffles no i just didn't want only a waffle i want a waffle for dessert jesus christ <laughs> good morning Gigi. Bacon is one of the worst things you could eat, kids. It's delicious. I like the eggs. We are currently outside in our driveway and we have our little poppers. The kids have their confetti pops. Yeah! What? Really, babe? Let me show you how it's done. Man. I didn't even know he had bought fireworks. I'm sitting here talking about confetti two. poppers. This is two to hundred vlogs, people. This is to y'all, all of our subscribers, our supporters. Thank y'all so much. Y'all do them in the air. Y'all strip. One. Two, three. Two, three. Two, three. Two, three. Two, three. It's hard. Twist it. This. Watch you learn. I can't. It's hard. Yeah. Oh, we're supposed to. Oh, you ain't supposed to rip that. You just might. Twist it. All you gotta do is twist it. You show me how to do it. I think you gotta rip you this off. Twist. No, you don't gotta rip nothing off. You just twist it. Not mine. Oh, Let me see it. I'm not gonna twist it. I'm just hard. I just Let me show you. Can I Look, show bro. I twisted and it ripped. No, not mine, bro. No, you don't know how to do it. Okay. Up in the air. Wait, hard, go. Do up. No. Go. No, I wanna do it, King. Sight. Yeah. Y'all, it's too hard for y'all anyway. Y'all don't know. Be able to do it anyway. Ah! You ready? Got me! Got me! All right, well, let's see. Give me these black cats, you know. Houston, what do you have to say to all of our subscribers, Houston? So today is a special day for us because it marks the 100th webisode. Meaning that we have been vlogging and this is our 100th video for y'all. And I am so happy and proud of us. Sprinkle me, baby. We have came through faithfully for y'all and we are loving it. This is just the beginning, you guys. So shout out to everybody that's been supporting from day one. We love y'all so much. How y'all like our new intro, man? Type in the comments. Tell me how y'all feeling that new intro, man. Looking real professional around this moment. <laughs> Lucky actually went out of his way to get us a new intro and actually surprised me with it. So I'm happy about that. And we're going to celebrate <laughs> this 100th 
vlog. You know, Mexicans look for any reason to celebrate throwing <laughs> barbecue, right? Uh, we are like always barbecuing, you guys. Before we go any further, I want to make an announcement. Drum roll, please. We got a, another pop up shop coming to Houston, Texas, H Town, Texas, this month, July 27th. This month, July 27th, Houston, Texas, pop up shop. We will be making the announcement of where the location is. But yes, July 27th, Houston, Texas, Luciano TV, pop up shop. Houston shows us so much love. I mean, we were. Hey, better, man, Dallas showed ranger. us a lot of love, though, man. Dallas, Dallas came through. Yeah, Dallas came through. So, Houston, y'all gotta, like, you know, put the stamp on it through, because, right? you know, we ain't about to play with y'all. So H Town people, all my H Town people, make sure you drop a little MOG, a little H MOG in the comments. And let us know you're gonna be there July 27th. Let us know it's real. Arizona, y'all are next. Thank y'all so much for watching again. It feels so surreal sometimes to know that there's so much love like all over the map, not just like in Texas, you know? So um, huge shout out to all the other states that watch us. If we didn't have all these kids with us, I would I wouldn't have no problem just jumping up and going to Arizona like next weekend or going to California. But man, it's hard traveling with a bunch of kids, man, because Houston be crying and screaming and the kids be fighting. Kingston and Gigi and Leah be arguing and it's just like And then that puts us in like a bad space. So um we be trying our best to just remain sane. I find this so attractive how my man's is that Lowe's. I don't want no more. Looking for tools to work around the house. Heller. Yeah. Pushing my son. Turn around, baby. Look at me. Let's make some eye contact real quick. We got baby some of this. For your grill? Wood chips. Hi. What you doing? <laughs> so we're at Loom's. And I don't even know what we're looking for. We're just looking for something. Dad's concentration face. <laughs> but that's the struggle and we'll be real with that. So what we're oh, looking sure. for is like this tool to cut down our tree because outside in our front yard it's a bush there's like a big but yeah it's a bush there's like <laughs> this big tall bush that keeps growing and growing and growing and it's like as tall as the house so we came to look for something that's gonna help us cut it down so we just got back home from Lowe's and it started pouring down all over again you guys houston weather is so bipolar like literally when we went to run errands earlier and stop that target it was like so hot i felt like i was melting and i wasn't even outside that long um and now it's like literally windy like the breeze is so strong and it's pretty chilly out there and it's raining i know it's crazy i think we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog here i know we didn't do much but we're just so proud of ourselves once again for um just accomplishing I know it's just such a little, like it's a small milestone, but 100 videos, you guys, 100 vlogs, if you really think about it, we've came a long way. Like I still remember when I was working in the medical field and we were vlogging at the same time. I still remember my engagement vlog, like oh my god, and now we're here like literally doing it, Just we just dove in and just started doing this and pouring our life onto y'all and just making y'all a part of us. So once again, we really appreciate appreciate all the support that y'all have been just pouring onto us all the love you know and and we just want to thank y'all i hope that y'all have a blessed day a blessed evening and always remember to stay true to yourself to always think positive and remain just full of love and joy and before i go i want to give a huge shout out to joanna garza because she said she had caught up on our vlogs and watched six vlogs straight back to back. So shout out to you, girl. If you want to be next to get a shout out on our videos, just make sure you turn on your post notifications and subscribe and also like and comment and let us know you did everything. And, you know, we might give you a shout out in our next video. Thank y'all so much again. I love y'all. And look who just found me. Houston. Say bye. I'm out here.
had breaking a sweat. I had bushes and trees that was growing way past the roof in the front yard. So I had to cut all that shit down. Before I go, man, I just wanted to touch on something real quick. On the last video, I, I mentioned something about uh, it's not good to be soaking your body in alcohol and drinking and stuff. And a couple people comment talking about, but you drink? Don't you drink beer too? Or did you quit drinking alcohol? Hold on, man. I just made a statement. I ain't saying I'm perfect. I never claimed to be an uh, angel or said I didn't drink. I'm just saying it ain't good to soak your body in alcohol, which it ain't. You know what I'm saying? Everything is cool in moderation. If you're gonna have one or two drinks, go on about your business if you're grown. You know what I'm saying? Do what you wanna do. But when you just blowing your whole paycheck on getting messed up for the whole weekend is what I was referring to. You know what I'm saying? But if you got your business together and you able to, you know what I'm saying, take care of your business and still be able to go have a drink or two, by all means, do you, homie. I ain't got all the answers. Don't listen to me. Y'all be thinking I'm trying to preach to y'all. I be trying, I done told you, I'm preaching to myself on these videos, man. I'm still learning every day. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be the best version I can be. And every day is a process. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting better every day. I ain't the same person I was yesterday. You know what I'm saying? Every day I'm growing. Every day I'm learning. I ain't up here like I'm just some guru or somebody who got all the answers. No, I don't. I don't got all the answers. I be waking up some mornings feeling just as lost as you. I be trying to sprinkle a little ism, tell you how I'm feeling every now and then. I ain't got all the answers. I ain't perfect. I'm still searching. I'm still learning. This is what a OG told me.